Our eyes were awakened with ceaseless diversities wherever we step our feet, wherever we navigate our eyesight. The noticeable fact that everything that we can see through our naked eyes is clearly and totally different. There are various species of plants, breed of animals, and objects with different physical features, and yet, they can still live and appear in this external world with no any conflict. In fact, they all have contributions in fostering progress and unity. Each of them has roles to play and has taught us tremendous numbers of learnings and one of those learnings is that everything will work successfully no matter how diverse it is as long as the spirit of solidarity exists. Each of us was born different and sadly some people were born blind. Their eyesight was being poisoned by ostracism and the influence of society. Sometimes the society itself is the one that enlightens people that cultural differences hinder people to be socially united and sometimes this leads to social animosity. We are truly circumfused in darkness, in darkness of how cultural differences destroy social harmony and oneness. Diverse cultures, races, languages, and religions have established boundaries among us and cover the eyesight of some of the people that cultural differences are not supposed to hinder us towards social unity, but rather it should congregate the heart, the mind, and the soul of each and every one of us and melt them in one path. Cultural differences have that certain power that binds us all in spite of our distinct characteristic, personal perspective, identity, and origin as humans. This is the right time for us to break the walls that separates social unity and diversity. Cultural diversity is the economic growth leading to a more fulfilling social, mental, and spiritual life. This captures the cultural principle that provides a sturdy basis for the promulgation of cultural diversity. As students, being culturally aware is vital to us because we are not just gaining pride for our whole culture, but we also have the chance to understand the culture of others. We learn to respect and we learn to embrace our differences, the differences of others, and in our own community. It can also encourage us to make a wider and deeper understanding about the similarities and differences of our own culture and the culture of others. Cultural diversity is not a barrier. It is actually the force that motivates people to make a development and progress. With the presence of cultural diversity, we also learn to be proud of our own culture and to be respectful to others. It is better if we're going to embrace one another where people share each other's stories of uniqueness and become more united while gaining personal perspectives and knowledge from themselves. This is the essence of being culturally different. This gives you the power to aspire for solidarity and embrace the flaws and differences of one another with no any negative judgment and prejudice. I have been existing in this external world for almost 21 years and I am one of the witnesses of how cruel and how unfair our life is. And those inequalities exist because of cultural differences, because of our own differences that become more complicated because people complicate it. In short, we are the real problems, not those differences. There is no such thing as a perfect and comparable person. We all make mistakes. I know that all of us have flaws and we are all different 
in our own unique way. And those differences will make us all beautiful, will make us all stand out, and will make us all as precious as a beast. We just need to be more appreciative and reverent in confronting differences. An article from the littleladybagshop.com said, Diverse classrooms promote creativity, intellectual capability, and collaboration. We are all the same. We may be differ in physical appearance, but we can be united as one family. We learn from each other and we learn to respect one another. If we are going to keep in our mind the word respect, then we can create a better society that has no discrimination, judgment, inequality, prejudice, and stereotypes. And only peace and unity will intervene among us. Martin Luther King Jr. said, Where the love and I for an idol of things, in the end, all will be blind. If you don't learn to live as brothers, we will die together as fools. We were all born equal. We were born free with pride and dignity. Let us all congregate. Let us all gather. Let us all unify. And let us all stand together as we promote social unity amidst diversity, where peace and unity are our lasting living legacy. Thank you.